All right, guys, this is Emilent DX80 Beam Shot Video Part 3. Uh, this will be the final Beam Shot video that we get. Um, this one's going to be a little different from the ones we normally do because normally we compare everything to the house. Uh, this time around, however, we're going to try to show some distance. The camera that we're using is, is great, I think, for, um, for some situations, but for distance, probably not so great. So we also took individual still camera shots of the differences in beams that we're actually going to post in this video as well because the differences in the beams are much more apparent um, when you look at the still shots compared to the camera. So we're really making this video hoping that you have an idea of the differences in the beams and the outputs at some distance, about 300 yards. Um, but if not, the still shots will be included in this video. So hopefully, at the very least, those will give you all a better idea. Uh, for comparison's sake, um, we're going to start off with my old school but ever-loved Olight. Uh, this is the SR95SUT. This light's very different from the others. This is a designated thrower. I've had this for over four years now. This is a single emitter. I believe this is the SBT70 LED in there, smooth reflector. So it's the exact opposite of the other two lights that we're gonna be comparing. And just to show you guys here, this is the uh, Olight SR95S UT. The UT is here in the insignia. That's how Olight does it, this, that's for ultra throwers. So during this time period, this was the first light from what I remember, LED light that was rated at more than a thousand kilo or, or one kilometer of throw. Um, one of my absolute all time favorite lights. Um, then the next light, just to show up again guys, this is the Ace Beam X80. Now, the candela on the Olight, the intensity is a quarter million. It by far has more intensity than any of the three lights do. Um, in fact, it has double the intensity, so the focus on it is double that of its next closest one, which is the um, Emilent DX80. Just to put this in perspective, because I think they're going to be very apparent, the differences in beams from the still shot videos, the X80 has the least <clears throat> amount of uh, candela. It has the least focus, the least intensity at just over 30,000. And then next and last will be the DX80 um, at hundred, just over 160,000 uh, intensity or candela is what it's rated at. So we're gonna do the DX80 by Emilent, the X80 by Ace Beam, and then the designated thrower, the Olight SR95 SUT. Uh, just to show you guys, this is the, the Emilent DX80. You can see on the tail cap here, DX80, Emilent, we've got the head here. Very similar, although the LEDs and everything are very different, but very similar in the fact that you have shallow, several shallow, uh, very high output LEDs like the X80 by Ace Beam. So without further ado, we're gonna start with the Olight, go to the X80 by Ace Beam, and then finish with the DX80. We're gonna stand in the middle of the road in our neighborhood. We've got about 300 yards down to the tree line. Again, I'm not sure how well this is gonna come up in video, but we are gonna give it a shot. So hopefully you guys will be able to pick up some of this. Um, here we go first with the Olight SR95 SUT. This is it in high mode. This is 1250 lumens and 250,000 candela. Just so you can see here on the road how tight and focused the beam is. And I will move it back out again to the tree line. Again, probably about 300, maybe even more than 300 yards away. All right, next is the Ace Beam X80. Pointed at the same tree line. I highly doubt you'll be able to see it. But this is it right here. Turbo, Turbo Max. That's Turbo Max. I'm sure y'all will be able to pick up even in the video the crazy difference in the amount of spill. But the light doesn't throw far at all. That's not what it's intended to do. It's putting out, this is 25,000 lumens, just a massive wall of light. All right. And then finally, guys, this is the new Emilent DX80 light at full 32,000 lumens. Point at the same spot. It might show up in the video, it might make it look like there's more flood than the X80, but I can assure you guys that there's not. There's just, it's just putting that many more lumens out so that you're, you're really seeing all 32,000 right now. So that was the Emilent DX80 at 32,000 lumens. I hope this video was helpful for you guys. I wish y'all could see it as clearly as we can see it here because the differences in the beams is just overwhelmingly obvious. Um, they each do their job. They each do their job very well. They're all very different lights. Right now, the Emilent DX80 light, uh, I've never seen a light put out this amount of lumens, and I don't question for a second that we're over 30,000 lumens with this light. So 
Um, awesome job there, Emilent. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. Stay safe. God bless.